immediately, I take a look at the statute and reading the range of punishment, I can't figure this out. Is it, is it three to life or is it or three to 20 or is it 25 to life? What's my sentencing range? Hey guys, this is Lee Berlant, Oklahoma's only attorney that dedicates himself just to special victim cases. And I'm gonna tell you, if you've been charged with a sex crime, it's probably pretty difficult as you're looking at the statute to understand what the appropriate sentencing range is for yourself. And the fact of the matter is, is that it is possible for lots of charges to have multiple sentencing ranges. Okay, Lee, well, what do you mean? Let's use child sexual abuse as an example. That one can have three potential sentencing ranges from zero to one in the county jail, okay, from zero to life in prison, or 25 to life in prison. Okay, well, what makes the difference? Well, the zero to one and the zero to life are both contained within the same sentencing range. And the jury will be given the option at the end of the case to sentence you within one of those two ranges. Okay. The difference between that, that zero to life and the 25 to life, comes with the age of the victim when the offense was committed. So if the victim was under the age of 12 when they were victimized, then that sentencing range jumps all the way up to 25 to life. So really the discernment that you have, the question that you're gonna have, the issue you'll have is trying to figure that out is, was the victim at the time that she's alleging that this occurred under the age of 12? And then that's what will change the sentencing range and jump it up to 25 to life. Otherwise, you're gonna be in that zero to life, zero to one range. All right, this is Leah, I hope that cleared that up for you. Till the next one.